Okay, so today will be a quick tutorial about how to program your Bofang motor. And as you can see, I've already opened one of the sites that sell this cable for about $20. It's quite cheap, should be around the same price around any part of the world. And next thing you need is a Bofang configuration tool. If you go to search one of the top sites and the form will have it something like this you will see a download link once you install it you're ready to do the magic so let's go and have a look The only thing to look here is the display cable, which I will show you in a video. Okay, as for the display cable, it's one of the two on the back of the display. As you can see, left and right, and we have one connected to a throttle. And the other one that goes right here, we need, it goes into a controller and it's connected already, as you can see, to my laptop. Okay, so after you connect the cable and install the program, choose the right port and uh, press the read flash. All values will be updated to the one set on your motor. If you want economic settings on your motor, so basically you can copy my profile because I set to be the most power saving mode possible. One important tip on this page, make sure that you set your current limit for 18 amps if you have 750 watts or less rated motor that's basically because Bafang cooling system for this type of motors is not good enough as a ultra hd model so just that in long term you will have a better life of your motor okay and in the second page pay attention to the stop delay that's because it determines how quickly your motor will cut off the power after you stop pedaling 10 milliseconds if you don't have an e-brakes and 25 milliseconds if you have e-brakes and on the last page make sure you have a low value for a start current unless you want to do wheelies something like a 10 or 20 percent would be just fine okay so once you set your values press right flash and go test your bike and see if you have the nice settings for your Bofang motor. So that will be it for this basic tutorial. I hope you understand basics to change the important things. If you need any more information, just leave a comment or check the article that I have linked in the description below. And thanks for watching. See ya!